In this video, I'm gonna teach you how to fix Black Ops 1 server not available. It's a very easy process, so make sure to follow along. In this video, I want to showcase a very straightforward method that allows you to play multiplayer either on zombies or the standard multiplayer for Black Ops 1. So for this method, all that you have to do is download plutonium. So as you might be aware, the Call of Duty Black Ops 1 servers are extremely old and while they are still maintained, to this day they have a lot of problems and a lot of vulnerabilities. Because of this, the community created Plutonium. Essentially, this is a launcher where you can store all of your Call of Duty games. You just have to select the game directory and you will be able to launch them from here. This is also important because they are going to have much better server support. So you will be able to join community servers with their included anti-cheat. So all that you have to do to use Plutonium is to go over to plutonium.pw and you will be able to look through everything. If you are unsure if this is safe, I recommend that you take a look at the documentation because they are going to describe the process here, but it is completely safe to use and you will be able to download it right away. So download the plutonium executable and install the launcher. You will have to create an account and once you are inside of the launcher, all that you have to do is locate your games. So usually they will appear at the left side of the screen and all that you have to do is click on them there. So click on Black Ops, Setup, and then you will have to locate your game folder. So for for example, if you are playing on Steam, it's usually going to be the C drive, program files x86, Steam, Steam apps, common, and then you will be able to select the executable file. Once you launch Black Ops multiplayer or zombies through the launcher, you will be able to get inside and join any of the servers through the standard server browser, and you shouldn't encounter any issues with connecting online. I hope I was able to help you on how to fix Black Ops 1 server not available. If this video helped you, please be sure to leave a like and subscribe for more very easy tips. Thank you for watching!